Hi, this is Monty Hipsch, the Google Guru, and today I'm very excited to talk to you. It's the middle of November, and Google has done a number of innovative things in the last month, and I want to talk to you about being found on the front page of Google and the only three ways you can be found here. The first thing to notice about this uh, screen, I've taken a uh, search on Flores Kensington London and done a search, and you can see a typical search results. The top in this purple area here is Google AdWords, and same as down the right-hand side. This is pay-per-click advertising, where you're competing on bidding for these search terms with other people. It's a, it's a competitive auction, and the people that uh, are showing up here are competing with each other in price and quality to occupy these spaces. It used to be called Sponsored Links, but now you can see Google has just renamed it Ads. That's the Google AdWords program. Competitive, cost-per-click, bidding environment. Now, the really exciting stuff is what we see down here, which is universal search. This is Google's, comes from Google Places, and this is 100% free. And it used to show this map over here, now it's on the right-hand side. And as you scroll up and down, you'll see the map moves over the ads and it stays next to these places. Google Places is 100% free, and it allows you to create a page, and I'll take you to one right here, a place page. So you can see for this florist, they have street view here, you can go and look around Google Maps all the information about the business. You can upload photographs and videos. You can get reviews. This is all 100% free, and it comes from Google Places. So to claim your own listing in Google Places, just do a search for Google Places in Google, click on the Google Places link, and you can log in here with an account, which is free to set up, and create your own Google Place page, which gives you the opportunity to show up in this free local search area on Google. Now, why are these positions so important? This eye tracking study uh, shows where people's eye, uh, the red is the hot spot of where their eye goes when they look at a search result page on Google. And the X's are where people have clicked. And as you can see, there is a sweet spot in the upper left-hand corner with that red intensity and then moving down the page. And the X's are where people have clicked. And these red lines are where the cutoff of the screen occurs. And as you roll down and you see different farther along the screen, you can see there's less and less eye movement and less and less clicks. So it's very important to be in this upper left-hand corner and preferably above the, the fold or the screen resolution. And Google knows this. So if we scroll down, we can then see that here are the organic listings. Now remember, these organic listings, these six or seven listings, are out of 52,000 different listings up here. So, and that's through search engine optimization of your web page. That's the third way to be found on this front page of Google. So all you need to do is Google SEO Starter Guide, and you'll see here official Google Webmaster Central. You click on that link, it takes you here, and here is the link where you can download the document that tells you virtually everything you need to know about search engine optimization. It's in 40 different languages, it's been updated on the 3rd of October, and it's 100% free. So, um, if we go back to our results page here, I want to show you, you've seen some popping up little screens. Google has recently added a preview tool. So if you mouse, if you click on one of these search boxes, you'll actually see a preview of the website that lives underneath. So you can actually look at what the front page of the website looks like before you go visit it. Now this is a new feature, it's called Google Preview, and it works not only for these local listings, but also for all the organic listings. So people can actually decide from looking at your home page, and that, that makes your home page now very important, whether they'll click through these links or these links and go to your website. Um, so there you have it. Pay-per-click advertising, right? Google Places, pay-per-click competitive advertising here, you're bidding. Google Places, 100% free, but you need to claim your listing. And search engine optimization. And we've shown you the three different ways that you can um, get information on this. If you're interested in AdWords, all you need to do is look to the right on this form on the page where this video is, fill out your contact details, and one of our friendly staff would be happy to talk to you about search engine optimization, pay-per-click advertising, claiming your listing in Google Places. Um, all of those are available to you. Just fill out the information and someone would be happy to talk to you about it. I hope this has been helpful. It's very, very important that you claim your free listing um, and also that you investigate search engine optimization and pay-per-click advertising so your web presence is effective and efficient and has a positive ROI for you. Thank you for your time. I hope you found this helpful. This is Monty Hipsch, the Google Guru. Goodbye.